whom the Lord abhorreth. Now, it says, who is it that it says, the covetous, comma, whom the Lord abhorreth. Right? The people are full of covetousness. God hates those people. And the reason why it's bringing that up is because the wicked is blessing the covetous. They're blessing the person that God hates. Why is this being brought up? Because you're not supposed to be blessing someone that God hates. Simple teaching. Again, though, we have people today who just want to bless everyone. God bless America. God bless the world. God bless everything. No, 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 no. You don't just bless everybody. Okay, there, there's, you know, there's blessings and there's cursings. And there's blessings that, that should go on people that you ought to bless. It's not just a blanket. You don't just bless everybody. That's why it's even being mentioned here. Like, why are you blessing a person that God hates? You know, people say, oh, God bless Israel. What? Why would you ask God to bless a people that have completely rejected Jesus Christ? Why would you want a blessing on them? The way that God deals with people is that when they're turned from him, you want God to bring down some type of judgment on them because you want them to be brought low and to be humbled enough to seek the Lord. God, from Genesis to Revelation, God is always trying, when, when people turn their back on him, when people turn away from the Lord, when people do things and go after strange gods, he's going to bring judgment for the purpose of bringing them back to him. If you actually care about and love the people, and love the children of Israel, and love the Jews, if you love these people, you're not going to just say, bless them when they reject Christ. Because it's better for them to, to not have a blessing and to be made humble and brought low and then receive Christ than it is to just try to bring blessing upon them and lift them up even more. Why would you want to do that? It, it's, it's not right. It's not biblical. And do you think God is loving the antichrists, people who just, just complete? No. Now, anyone who's not given over to reprobate mind, God wants them saved. But you're not going to accomplish that by just bless everybody. 